All right. Um, wait, let me just check real quickly in OBS. No, that's my mic. Um, that's the desktop. That's webcam with no sounds. Yeah, I can hear it now too. It should be gone. No? Can you still hear me? Well, I can still hear me. Oh, oh, no, no, no. I know what it is. I know what it is. I know what it is. Um, let me just... There we go. It should be gone now. It's gone? Awesome! Oh, then we can go. Um, yeah, where was I? Where was I? Perhaps for the... Um, what's it called? The profane capital. Yay. Yeah, that's it. That is what I was doing. Um, again, if I occasionally glance that way, that's because of the level bit there. Screen over here, and I might just alt tab between that and well, that's that's my browser, uh, OBS, the software. There we go. Yeah, I can see myself in real time. Well, yeah, that's actually real time, with a weird delay between this screen and that screen. But you know, um, yeah. So where was I? I did some. Preparations. I upgraded a barbed straight sword because of the uh, blade auxiliary, and that's because there are some enemies that are really, really annoying, but are really, 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 really weak to bleed. So there we go. So I also can I just see that here. No, I can't see that here. I also went ahead and it gets the Doris Nora miracle because. That causes bleed build up. I also went ahead and put on lightning stake instead of lightning spear. It is quite a nice animation though. Look at this. Bam. It's it's just a wee bit slow. Um, I did equip the Saint Ring. I equipped the Saint Ring for one more attunement slot. But it, it's still rather slow. Well that's probably just fine. It looks epic. That's it. And if we ever find ourselves against some invader and he thinks, oh, he's gonna throw a lightning spear, let's move in quickly then. Yeah, they're gonna be in for one hell of a surprise. Um, and I was just looking at possible uh, infusions for my barbed straight sword because, well, the damage output isn't all that hot, me being a faith build, and, well. Not being able to really, really put in the uh, uh, skill investments. And I came to the conclusion that a blessed infusion here isn't all that bad if you're looking just at the uh, attack rating. But you can't really infuse it after that or you know put a put a buff on it or use a resin or anything so this blood infusion upsets to uh, uh 50 auxiliary which is nice but i might just go ahead and simple raw infusion there we go huh. and for um, what was I gonna call it? What was I gonna say? To be complete, I should probably talk about my choice of uh, catalyst right here. I have the canvas talisman I gives. I also have this stupid. Well, it's not stupid. This uh, sunlight talisman. Um, 
Yeah, not gonna work with that. Not gonna work with that. You see here the uh, the uh, the spell buff, where it basically determines um, your your damage output, and on the canvas talisman, it's it's higher than the uh, sunlight talisman. So nice, easy switch. Um, also, your weapon skill costs a little less FP. Cleric's chime is pretty much on par with my canvas talisman, and thing is, chimes overall do better. Uh, damage overall the higher spell buff, but the weapon art on uh, the uh, talismans is, is way way better. I should show you guys. Yeah, oh, way too many items. There we go. Let's see. Um, cleric's chime. Weapon art is. Gentle prayer, some HP regen. As long as and you can see it in the uh, symbol underneath my uh, uh, health bar, underneath the hut. Uh, it only works as long as you have it equipped. So now it's gone. The weapon art of the talisman is the glow. It. it just performs the spell you've equipped, but it gives you hyper armor. Makes it uh, less likely for you to be interrupted while casting. So I prefer that over um, the uh, the HP regen. And can I? That's a bit too heavy. That's fine. Oh, yes. All right. I just noticed that the, um, uh, uh, thingy here on my uh, laptop screen says, "Oh, there are two people watching." Um, I just double checked, and it's just you mute and uh, me. It, it counts me as just just watching the bot program. Anyway, yeah, seems like we're ready to go. All right, profane capital. Here we come. Mm. Actually, for this bit, I may want. I should. I don't want to forget this part. I should really clean up the. Uh, my storage. Let's see where are my rings. Um, not gonna use you. Not gonna use you, 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 you. Another. There we go. Lonely, so lonely in the chat box. Yeah, I know. I know. I uh don't have many fans. Um I'm I'm sorry mutant, you're you're the most loyal one. And if you're lonely, just just spread the word, you know, like um, submit to your evil overlord and and join his uh, his uh, weekly live streams. 
So maybe we get some more people. Uh... Wait, did I get the? No, oh, I didn't. Uh, get get some more get some more action going on here. All right, so that's that is where we um entered the profane capital over there. There's uh Erythil dungeon and there's the gargoyle that we faced earlier, and this is a drop we're not gonna survive, which isn't really necessary because well we can just take another way down to get to that part. We are. Going into some dungeony parts instead of going to the boss room. Now we've got some statues of baldies here. Uh, I'm not really sure what's going on here. Baldy McBalderson and his his brother Terence. Yeah, and, and this is the extended family. Right, I don't know what this is supposed to represent. Uh, they seem to be guarding against something. I'm not really sure what or how. Maybe the gargoyles, but I don't know. Pets on shoulder, I got to work for most loyal, eh? Yes, yes, you do. Yes, you do. You, you are the most loyal. But... That that's like being a a a parent or something, and your child says you're you're my best mommy ever, or you're my best daddy ever, and and you're like yeah, but I'm the only one you have. So, yeah, I don't know, but yes, you're the most loyal one. So you you got my award for that. Something something. And that's where my phone is not right, so... Ding! You've got mail. How very professional once again. Not even turning off your phone. Ah, alright, let, let's make it a bit less lonely. Um, you have an odd, odd superpower, uh, mutant. And I don't know why I, should, I look at my, my, my laptop screen like that, because if I'm addressing someone, I should just look into the... Into the um, 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 Camera, there we go, and address them like that. I'm an idiot. And that's ding, a counter for a uh, hashtag team. And here we just have some, uh, some more coins. Don't give up. Alright, okay, thank you. Thank you, mister. You deserve praise for that uh, positive message. Alright. Uh, uh. Oh. Can we see? No. Gargoyle. Because why not? And these guys begging over there probably for more hair or something. I don't know. And he's like, what's happening with my with my hands? Why are they so sweaty? That, that's because these gargoyles turned up the heat. And and these guys down there did too. Daddy! No! No. No. <laughs> what? Daddy issues? What the? Who's got daddy's issues? Not daddy's issues. I'm just gonna ignore you. I don't care about you. Who who has daddy issues? I don't. All right, just some crystal lizards. Oh, get back here! There you go. All right, just just be careful where you walk here because um, you might just drop down into some unpleasantness. My screen says two watchers, so props to you. Yeah, I know it counts me as a watcher. I, I'm I'm logged in. It knows that I am there. It's yeah. I know. I know. 
Thank you, Twitch, for making me feel slightly better about myself. I have two watchers. Life goals are passed. No, 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 just just a rest gold coin. No, nothing, nothing too interesting. Here we are. And if you look carefully, you are already warned about that guy. Annoying NPC. Really annoying NPC. Top five annoying NPCs. Number all of them. That guy. X D D D D D. <laughs> yeah, I agree. I agree with that sentiment. All right. So, um, Dark Souls one had a toxic toxic area, or at least a poison swamp. Dark Souls two had a poison swamp, and you know, the, when they were developing Dark Souls three, they were thinking like, you know, what do we need more of? Poison swamps. There are like three in this game. And this is the second you encounter. Mind you, this one is not mandatory. By any means, this is basically a side area. You don't need to come here. But, you know, just, just for completion's sake, I'm going to do it. I'm just going to do it. That moment when you are your own most... Mutant, you make me sad. You make me a sad, sad boy. No, I'd like to think that you are my most loyal watcher. I mean, I watch myself all the time. And that sounded better in my head, actually, to be honest. All right, let's let's do this. And I'm just gonna go ahead and just swap this really quickly out for a composite bow. Let's let's pull these guys in. Oh. You stupid, stupid centipede. Wait, did I miss? I missed. Oh, that's because it has a short range. Go composite bow. All right, let's let's assure you guys. You can block these guys just just all all day instead of you know like failing to dodge them like I do. Yeah, some purging stones. Not that we need them. But because we can grab them. These guys do drop uh, purging stones, by the way. Amongst other things. And this is an annoying bit that you can actually just skip. Because there is nothing really interesting here. But, you know, I'm just going to show you guys anyway. Because I am like that. And do know that this is not just your regular poison swamp, this is toxic in you. Come here. Come here, fam. Narcissism? I'm not narcissistic. I'm, I'm totally not narcissistic. And uh, I don't know if you've noticed, but I did remove the chat from uh, the overlay. Because I felt that it took too much of the screen. So, you know, if you're watching this on YouTube and, and you feel like you're missing out on some inside joke. Um, two things may happen. I may put the uh, chat back in for the next live stream. Or I may just be like, yeah, tough for you guys. I don't care. But uh, you can try, though, you can try. Alright, Curse by Ring is actually quite a nice ring. I mean, it does up your uh, Curse Resistance. But how am I narcissistic? I'm not narcissistic in any way, shape or form. I leave that to others. As in, you know, like praising me. 
I don't need to praise myself. Yeah, I'm just a shriving stun. You know what? I should probably just switch these with some cookies. Toxic by Britney Spears in 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 DS. I don't know if, if if I should be impressed that you that you even think of that, or you know that I should be judging you on the fact that you know that that, that that's what you think of. I'm I'm gonna give you the benefit of the doubt and go with the former, but <laughs> still, uh, you know maybe I should add something for next time like a uh, uh like a, like a bits underneath uh, uh, in the screen where you where where we can see something like a playlist or something uh, and I can just add suggestions to that. I don't know. That that might be a, t a thing. Right. Um annoying guys, really weak to bleed and I should probably just go ahead and get my barf tracer ready. That's a lot of damage, just just one hit bleed effect. Oh. Uh. There we go. They drop dunk bars, this one drops an Eleonora, which is not even a good weapon, I don't think. Maybe you can't see. I I guess I I can't see indeed. What can't I see? Or you're just you just kindly providing me the lyrics off of Toxic. I don't know. I do know the song, but um I, I just can't, can't, can't bring it back for some reason. All yeah, right, do more of these these boyos to go. These stupid hippo ogre hands thingies, whatever they are. They are resistant to pretty much all kinds of damage except for bleed. And if they they grab you, if they you know like uh, go go. On, Stand up on, on two legs and charge you, and they, they grab you, which pretty much is like a lot of damage, especially if you're toxic. You are probably be, gonna be one shot, of, but they do drain you of your soul. Baby, can you see? I don't know. I don't know how the song goes. I'm just. You know what? I'm just gonna look, look it up real, real quick. There we go. Now I can also. Oh, it's it's that we're doing like these uh, digital uh, uh, this digital digital thing for uh, uh, Christmas, um, where you have to uh, uh, I like drawing tickets. Um, I, j I just filled in my tickets online when shared it with my family, and apparently I I did get a ticket back finally. Yay! <sighs> yeah, first end of the song. Yeah, I'm, I'm just gonna look it up real quick. Toxic, Britney Spears. Oh uh, yeah, it's that one. See now, I recall. No, not you, at least. I don't want to see you, Britney. No, just no. Alright, we're back. They kept sleeping. Oh, how very nice of them. Dun dun. That's my line. 
You're stealing my lines. You didn't. You're way too loyal. All right, time time to uh, make these guys go wakey wakey. Yeah, as you can see, massive damage for bleed. There is one. No, 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 no. Oh, yeah, I totally forgot about that. If you manage to um, hit them while they are charging you, you will stagger them. And I kind of wish you could throw cookies like regular throwing knives. But unfortunately, we cannot do that. Yay, dunk pies because I like pies. Spoiler alert, I actually don't. They are way too sweet. Alright, and what did we get for this? What's our grand reward? Uh, three perching stones. Yeah, you can just skip this bit. It's it's totally not relevant. Except if you want to look at more baldies. Here, this guy again. I don't know what he's thinking. Should I use this hand or my other one? Maybe if I sit on it a while before I start, it won't feel like my own hand at all. Alright, maybe we should rate this like uh, M for Mature. And if you look hyped for the concert next Sunday, I. Totally am, yeah. I totally am. Right, just, just in between. If you listen very carefully, and uh, maybe I should stop talking for a bit, you can hear some snoring upstairs. Yeah. But I am totally hyped for the concert, concert next Sunday. I'm really looking forward to it. Um, not sure. You know. But, but I, I'm an idiot. I'm, I'm chaotic. Um, I haven't even decided yet how I'm gonna go, like, with the, uh, by train or by car. I, I don't. I, I haven't even checked uh, what time it ends. Because that's gonna influence my decision quite a bit. Alright, here we are. And there's another one sleeping just there. Alright, let, let's see if we can make this uh, this quick. Just some Carter's Rouge, and we should be able to see that the. Oh, you can't really see it. But that just ups the uh, bead auxiliary. And that's a little damage. Just be careful, they, they, they sit on you. But if, if, if you do something with bleed, you're, you're gonna dispatch them quite quickly. If not, well, prepare for bad times. Quartos for Rob, let's, let's take a quick look at that description. Um, there we go. Rope worn by the court sorcerers of the profaned capital. The formal gold stitching suggests they may also uh, they may have also been oracles, and that's pretty much a reference to the uh, maybe a reference to the um, daughters of the witch of Islip. There are many sorcerers who claim uh, heirship to the great sage Big Head Logan, a character from Dark Souls One, and the profaned capital houses one of the two leading schools, and that's interesting because. In all of Dark Souls, I think this is the only reference to another school than um, the Finham Dragon School. Alright. Now that I'm not distracted anymore. Um,
you know, I don't know what to make of this message. I sincerely do not know what to make of this message. <laughs> Just you. <laughs> oh, it made me it made me giggle. It made me snort, so there you go. I'm gonna pause. Is this me? I don't know. Maybe I should think on that. Ooh, another thing you said, you're an idiot. Yeah, I... <sighs> this is just some rubbish. <laughs> just like I am. See, who is narcissistic now? Who is narcissistic now? I just said I'm rubbish. I'm not narcissistic at all. Hidden path ahead. No, there's not. You can, you can just slam your sword. Just here everywhere and it will not reveal anything whatsoever there's nothing here giggle snort yeah that's like my mid no that's not my middle name and hey look it's a mimic oh, i sincerely hate mimics Again, you're fighting in a small space, so just watch your camera angle. All right, just just the cord source for stuff, and that's one of the better stuffs in the game. Catalyst used by the cord sorcerers of the Prevent Capital, very powerful when wielded by an exceptionally intelligent sorcerer. Um, if I recall correctly, above 40 intelligence is the best scaling stuff or something. Uh, the court sorcerers laid claim to the legacy of the renowned Big Head Logan, going so far as to emulate him with copies of the stuff he used. Like pretty much all stuffs, steady chance you do this, uh, your sorceries are a bit stronger for a short amount of time. Um, I believe that the steady chant of the court sorcerer stuff is the strongest, it provides the biggest boost, it also lasts shortest. So there's a bit of a trade-off. I myself like going the midway, like uh, medium buff and medium length. Because that's overall, I feel, the most uh, dependable. I know your middle name, XDDDD. No, you don't. It... It's actually Kickle Snort. I was lying. It, it's it's Kickle Snort. All right. There's a guy wearing the court sorcerer um, stuff set, uh, court sorcerer stuff, and the gargles mace thingy. I forgot the name. And he's really annoying because his weapon does a shitload of damage and. There we go. And his sorceries are quite strong. You can't even sneak up to him properly. Like that. There, there, there we go. Let's see. No, you don't. No, you don't. No, you don't. No, you don't. Told you. <sighs> he does drop, drop Logan skulls, and these are pretty much the strongest sorcerers you're gonna get in a game. The Giggle Snort the Loud. Uh, the Giggle Snort Loud, yeah, that, that's me. I'm, I'm a loud. Wrath of the freaking gods. I used to love this spell in Dark Souls 1. Great Powerful Shockwave. Primal form of Force creates a powerful shockwave. Wrath of the gods is an epic tale, while Force is but a woefully incomplete version of that yarn. This primal account of profound fury emits a shockwave that also inflicts damage. So it's basically just the same as... Uh, as force, except that it's slow, 
way slower. And it does damage and it needs two slots. Two demon slots, well, first is one. Overall, I feel that force is way more useful. But your millage may vary. If you're doing this with the uh, weapon art of talismans, uh, and you have some decent armor, you can just push through any attack and do some damage. But I, I don't think that's the way to go, at least not in PV, PvP or something. Alright, but now I'm, I'm curious. What did you think my uh, middle name is? Been able to acquire... Oh, right. Yeah, right. Cool, cool. I don't care. Alright, so we can go up the stairs or we can go ahead and jump to this bit. And if you're feeling cheeky, you can actually aggro the uh, stupid sorcerer. Then... jump ahead and half the time he's gonna st stand over there you know throwing spells at you and if you have something like a bow gift you can just shoot him from here and i did that at the wrong screen i should be looking at that anyway nothing of interest here except and here we use the old cell key. Yes, I'm a saint. No, wait, I'm evil. Now I'm confused. Huh. A titan slap for your trouble. Right, so remember, um, the legendary slabs are referenced in the item description of pretty much all the uh, 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 regular titanite items description. So here we have an actual slab. And do note these runes here. Um, one day I may actually work with the motivation to try and translate them, but... Anyway, Titanite Slab for weapon reinforcement set to once belong to the gods. Reinforces weapons to their highest level, so from plus 9 to plus 10. Titanite Slabs are smithing materials of the gods, and weapons reinforced with slabs will be admired no less than their precious legendary weapons. Yeah. There are a total of 14 slabs to be obtained in the game, and that's with the DLC. You know, I'm, I, I can't actually answer that, so I'm, I'm not gonna... I'm not gonna... Alright, for the, uh... You know... Cheerful chap that he normally is, he does sound quite solemn here. And do not, and that's why I wasn't seeing him last episode, because I was standing. Hey, look, between his legs. I don't know why I'm staring at that, but we were standing beyond that lag, just, just up there. And we could see some enemies they were about to encounter, and this is... The, the, the giants that we saw last episode. All right. And this should be the item that I should have grabbed first before farming, because here we have the Covetous Gold Serpent Ring. And the Covetous Gold Serpent Ring, there we go, fallen foes are more likely to drop items. Wait, let me just show you guys. Item Discovery 107. Item discovery 157. Might get flat 50 on top of that. Alright. Um, <laughs> yeah, let me just go ahead.
All right. But we freed Sigvard. Unibro can continue his journey, as can we. All right. Nothing of interest here. And be careful, because we saw some enemies here. But now they're gone. What happens? Yeah, they, they just turned freaking invisible. And there goes my HP bar. No, 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 no. Don't kill me, please. Hmm. Give me my HP back. Or maybe I should just ignore those guys. Anyway. Jailer's key ring. So now we can finally access all these locked cells in the Erethyl dungeon. Uh, can I... You guys just not bother me. Alright, best use of black fire bombs ever. I'm not gonna need you guys. You hate your Wi-Fi, did you? Uh, did you? Uh, uh, DC. Alright, it's it's time to uh, slay some giants. Let me just grab this thing. And buff up. There we go. And three, two, one. It constantly says error. Yeah, that's because you're watching a living error. All right, lots of rats. Big dude. You will hurt the rats. And I'm being hurt by the rats as well. The rats will, by the way, constantly respawn as long as the giant is alive. But they will also respawn if you reload the area, so there's a thing. Come on. Nope, that hurt. That hurt as well. There we go. Plus the... Come on! There we go. Here we have Titanet Chunk, dropped by the giant. Uh, Profane Flame, nice pyromancy. Which does reference, you know, the whole Profane Capital and stuff. And the rest is just some upgrade material. And there we can see Secret still sitting, still pining. Come on. You know what? I'm done with you rats. No more self-deprecating jokes for the next 30 minutes. Oh, oh, how about it? That is a challenge. That is a challenge. But, but, but how are you going to hold me to that? You can't. Uh, you know, I'm not even going to... Nah, I'm going to bother. Because lots of mimics. Again, create some space here. Because... Otherwise, the camera is going to screw you up. And you're going to be grabbed and you're going to die like I am. Because it's a small space. Just like that. So... Sigh. 
GM mutant, how are you gonna hold me to that challenge? How are you even gonna do that? Alright, let me just sprint back really, really quickly to the spot we were. Run, run, run. Run, Forrest, run! Alright. I'll just do that. The appreciate thing. I know it's difficult for you. Yeah, like, but what did I say? Self depreciating. Wait, where did I go wrong? Where did I cook up? I want to understand. Oh, no, 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 no. No. No, it is actually a soft scene. It's not a hard C like a K because it, it's from a derivative. I, I think, I feel. Alright, alright, alright. Time, time to get this. Uh, time to get this. Uh, time to figure that out to the bottom. I am. Uh, what's it called? Streaming? No. No map. No. No! <sighs> so... Uh... You know what? Where is it? I had this, uh... uh is it here? Is it here? No, it's not here. No, right, I'm just just gonna throw it in Google Translate and see what the uh, uh first thing he says. Can I change this around? I can change this around. I can I change this around? Do we need this? No. It's self-deprecating. Okay, very good. But, but, can I unfortunately can't show it? I'm just gonna put it in a chat. But it's it's without the uh, the first eye. It's self-deprecating. Let me put in... No! Because with an I, it's depreciating. Alright, are we gonna play it like that? Are we gonna play it like that? Are we... Here we go. <laughs> Can I ask you a question? Well, can you? Oh, no, no. Can you ask me a question? <laughs> sure you can. You just did. It's gonna be fine. I'm not gonna bite your head off. Well, not literally at least. Uh, that's not the that mama's going. I'm gonna go with. There we go. Um, I don't know if I should take that. How should I take that? I'm, I'm, I'm just gonna try and ignore that statement. Thank you. Mute. You were about to ask me a question, I believe. And that's just fine. Everyone can ask me questions. That's why I am live. So people can uh, chat to me and uh, ask me stuff. Which is totally fine. You can ask me anything. Um... I may not answer that, that's just a thing. Alright. Ow! Oh. 
you know what? I'm gonna fry your rats. There we go. That's one dead mimic. And it gives you Dragon Slayer Lightning Arrow. You can use these only with a great bow. How long is your attention span? Is, is that seriously your question? That is your question. How long my attention span is. Uh, that totally depends on what I'm doing. That totally depends on what I'm doing. If, 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 um,. I'm doing multiple things. It's really, really short because I I do get like then I see something and then I'm like indeed distracted. Otherwise, I I, I can focus on things. I, I can really focus on things. All right, here we are. Lightning bolt. Now that's seriously your question. How long is my attention span? And of all the things that you can ask me, that's what you're going to go with. Like, that's earnestly the most important question for you. It's not even like, hey, what's your favorite color? What's your favorite food? No. How long is your attention span? Why, well, thank you, mute. There we go. Death and I chunk. Just some souls. Nothing interesting. Um, down here. Where are all, all these rats back? I don't like rats. So I'm just gonna run. I'm not even gonna care. Twelve seconds. No, I won't bite you. I won't bite you. Hard. And here we are back at the start of the Aerithil dungeon, so time to open up all these stupid cells and, uh, you know, grab the last items here and move on to the, uh, to the boss fight of the area. Where's the other one? Yeah, there it is. There's the golden coin, nothing too interesting. Oh, easy there, fella. Okay, okay. I'm always easy. And that actually sounded better in my head than... Maybe I should think before I speak. That, that might be... A smart thing to do. All right, just just the prisoner chiefs ashes. Not gonna bother you guys. You don't even give me a lot of souls or anything. Suddenly the stream is PG-16. Okay then, are we just established it and for mature? 
after I made that joke about the guy with his hands. And you just decided to make it PG-16. It's just like how you interpret my, my, my things. I mean, it was a completely innocent statement, and, and you just... You just made it something else. It's, it's all your fault. It's all your fault. Nothing is my fault. Uh, yeah. Alright, let's... Get to the last bit of... And the profane capital. And let me also just clean up my inventory just a wee bit. Don't need that. Don't need that. 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 No. 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 Not even. Why do I have so many of these? Alright, looks good. But actually I am I am way too easily distracted because there is this question nagging at the back of my mind and I I, I knew earlier what it was and then I got distracted and now I don't know what it is anymore. Then I have the necking feeling also that it's like more than one question, more than one thing I wanted to say. Uh, Alright, so if we have a gargle just there, and these guys will throw fire bombs. Fire balls, not fire bombs, fire balls at you. Yeah, I did that, I did that. All right, you stupid girl, come on. Oh. There we go. Yeah, some great arrows. And here we find some salts. There we go. All right, mind you, there's a gargoyle somewhere. Somewhere. Hiding. There are multiple hiding. There's one. And there's some enemies down below. So if you just go downstairs here, this guy will pop down and be like, Yo, mate. Sandwiched. So let's just lure them one by one. No. Or there we go. Oh, he's ignoring us. That's good. That's very good. Oh. As you can see, these guys aren't all that intimidating, but they do have quite a high soul yield. So if you are 
uh, looking for a place to do some dedicated souls farming. This is probably the case because or the the place because if we look behind that cargo, we can see a whole army of these Irithyll nobles. All right, time to know this thing. There we go. What did you want to ask them? Yeah, I don't know. I forgot. Um, do note the scenery. Something went terribly wrong here. And these guys are obviously not enjoying themselves. Ah, oh, handmade dagger. Worst dagger in the game. But it oh it does replenish a bit of FP mana with each hit, so there's that. And before I'm gonna go grab the items down there, we can actually go back a bit and approach it from above. Oh oh I should take a turn there. I actually remember something. Um, I actually remember something. You have an old superpower. Mute. How did you come to that? I'm just gonna say attention span. Yeah, X D D D D. <laughs> I know. All right. Only Slayer Grey Bow. Can't use it, obviously. It does have quite some high uh, 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 attribute requirements. Uh, and you do great by hunting down in an eastern land where tales are told of its use in slaying giant haunt. Oni. Drawing a bow of this size takes time and leaves the user vulnerable. Only specialized great arrows can be fired from the bow. I love great bows, but they're not all that practical in use. So yeah, did Senpai notice you? There's the question. <gasps> it took him some time, but he got there. He figured it out eventually. It's a question. It's an actual question, yeah. Interesting to note. Well, the... Um, Style is basically the same as in the previous statues. These guys aren't bald. Really, really important detail. And another detail, and that's something for a future area. All the gargles we've met so far here don't have a hat. So these inanimate ones do have hats. Dun, dun, dun. All right. Well, you are noticed by your senpai every day. That is that is true. That is true. That is completely true. You are not not. That depends on um, your senpai, I guess, and how you define, you know, senpai. If it's like in a meme, then okay, I I I get you. I get you. Also, a nice Pokemon Pokemon game you got. Uh, you mean, you mean Showdown? Ah, 
Come on there, buddy. Because Showdown is for uh, competitive play. Now, I don't really do competitive playing with Pokemon. But at one time I was talking to this group of players and we were thinking of doing like uh, free for alls. And then it's nice to uh, have a program where you can easily look at the uh, stats and compare stats of, of mons, you know, before going ahead and genning a bunch of them. And yes, I, I do gen. But that's okay because I don't do competitive play, so I won't be using them in any official capacity. And if I were to do something in a official capacity, I do have a lot of Pokemon just just Brad, but you know, pretty perfect with the, the perfect IVs and EV trained and all. So yeah. Who is your senpai? I didn't ask that. Now you're just presuming my questions. But it's the meme lord, the lord of memes. The dankest dude. Is it Thomas the Dank Engine? I mean... Chuk chuk, my foe. Alright, here we have an ember. Yay! It was a trap all along. Speaking about traps, here, two mimics side by side. And you know what? I'm not even gonna bother. I ain't even gonna bother. This, by the way, is the Perfect spot to farm for. Um, there we go. Go back to sleep. You too. To farm for the uh, symbol of Everest because you can just keep your bear hound and then just hit them once after you hit them with the hunter charm. Like. Alright. Freed up the wrong hand. Just like this. And you can use one hunter charm to. Access both of their stuff. So I'll just check if there's any st stuff in there. No, go back to sleep. And you too, go back to sleep. And you can do it just again and you know do, do this five times before you run out of the hundred charms. Rest, the bonfire, come back, do it again. A perfect farming spot. Oh, I know my best superpower. What is your best superpower then? Like you have several of them? Wait a sec. What are your superpowers? Then I'm curious. I am genuinely curious. Hmm. All right, we are by the by here at the uh, the boss fight. So it, it's a gimmicky boss fight. Um, the boss is resistant to pretty much everything in the game, and he has a huge, but not just huge, a massive health pool. 
So you're not, not going to put a dent in there that anytime soon. But if you grab the weapon at the other end of the boss room, here's weak to that. It's not a good weapon. Uh, it just has a weapon art that, that staggers him. And if you did see Quartz questline, he will join you here in the fight. Telepathy. That's your best superpower. Alright, alright. What am I thinking? Yeah, you've got some time to think about that. And try and reach into my mind. Because I'm just going to focus on this boss fight. There we go, Onion Bro. Yeah. Huge. Huge. Huge guy. All right, let's let's just go right past him. And grab ourselves. The Storm Ruler. As in the ruler of storms. There we go. As you can see, that does some damage on him. This not so much. By the way, he can and will kill Siegward if you're not quick enough. And that's already phase two. No, you're not. Just leave my onion bro friend alone. You can just time it just right with your buddy to keep him staggered. But that does require a secret to actually put in some work here like that. Come on. No, 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 no. Yep. All right. That was a fist to my face. Thank you, Sigurd. Thank you, good old friend. Alright, that's our third lord. Yeah, left by his own, he just dies. Well, not in here. All right, let's just. Ah, no, cut scene, cut in. Oh, you're either thinking about how hard you're gonna feel at the boss fights, Onion Bro, or someone special to you. Uh, yeah, yeah, I, I, I do feel, I do feel uh, everyone around me, so. There is that. I, I did, I did, I do feel everyone's special to me. Yeah. I wasn't thinking of that, but it's, it's a true thing, it's a true thing. But I was pretty sure that I was going to ace this fight because it is a hard fight. This is pretty much the easiest boss fight in the game. And I still have that stupid, stupid storm ruler kept making that infernal, infernal noise. And 
There we go. You know, now you've said that, I told you I could read your mind. Uh, yeah, now I am thinking about it. Now I am thinking about it. Alright, we got the Basin of Vows from a dying... What's it called, Emily? Let's see, Basin of Vows. Tell is used in old ceremony in which Lotharic Knights take their vows. It's only a formality now, but... It remains as an empty practice. Place this basin and the statue of Beheading Knight. Well, there are multiple in the game, but they are referring to this guy. Um, I was like, I don't want to do that just yet, because I want to do some stuff before going into this bit. And then I did it. Because I'm a big, big idiot. I don't like this boss fight at all. A dancer of the Boreal Valley. The Dancer of the Boreal Valley. Is an annoying, annoying, annoying boss fight, and I would love to keep my souls because I want to spend them. But hey, maybe I'll, I'll do this boss in just one go. This once. Alright, I have my stuff equipped. Do I have... See? Oh! Well, that does actually less damage than I anticipated, but... I'm at low FP and I wanted to use my spells for this boss fight, so I'm just... Just, just, just gonna die, apparently. Why? Thank you, Miss Dancer. Reverse telep telepathy, yeah, that that must be it. That that must be it, undoubtedly. Uh, all right, I'm just gonna grab my souls, and then we're gonna do what I wanted to do here. Oh, there we go. Because I just want to use this. No. Wait, wait, what's happening? What did what, what, what I'm doing? Uh, there we go. Well, was I gonna get that? How's your weekend going? Or week, whatever, yeah? It's... No, we've, we... Have we reached that part yet? Where we, uh... We're gonna do just, just the, uh... Small talk. Uh, fine, I guess. I think. I had a birthday yesterday. So if I look tired, it's because it got really, really late. And I also had to work. And stuff and everything. So yeah, 
It's, it's okay. Okay, weak. Oh. No, that's fine. There we go, blocking some bleed damage. And in stage 2, she grabs a second sword, and uh, it's gonna be really, really hard. No! There we go. She's weak to dark lightning, I believe. Bleed. Which I'm trying to proc right here. But I'm a failure of a person and I'm gonna die horribly any minute now. Oh, that hurt. There we go, that's some deep damage. Uh, trying to keep the conversation flowing. Yeah, that's hard because I'm, I'm getting really distracted here by these balls. And that's gonna hurt. We we're almost there. Oh, oh, I almost forget that one. After that jump attack, she seems open, but she is not. So, don't do as I do when going for the kill. But, go backwards. And that's fine, that suit ended. There we go. Ah, oh, air fire destroyed. Yes, in one go. Then that's a celebratory acid flask. All right, all right. Amber, uh, thinky, snivel, bonfire, and in three, two, one. Really weird cutscene. All right, uh, it's gonna be really, really hard. That's what. So who is making this PG-16, eh? Sure as heck isn't me. And I have no idea who thought it would be a good, good idea to put in a mechanism like that. I mean, think of the children, really. Oh, I'll bet that's what she said. Right, right. I'll bet that's what she said indeed. Thank you, Mutant, for being a very, very loyal follower and providing me with, you know, just, just, just the right context for every situation. Really, um, I'm so glad you joined me. Oh, yeah, I know what I was gonna ask. Uh, since you asked me about next Sunday, uh, I probably will be doing a stream. Um, but I'm gonna do it early and actually I was really really close because I do have like the uh, Release of the new unsets of magic and the unset in magic is basically a joke set it it contains all stupid jokes and some some uh, 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 
extra mechanics that you you know you can't just put into any set because it's it's way too weird. So joke set, unset, and that release or at least pre-release is gonna be Sunday next Sunday, but it's gonna be like in the in the noon, so not really too handy if I want to you know go in time to Utrecht. Um, why did I say it like that? It's Utrecht, duh. Um, so I just, might just do as well some streaming early on the day, like maybe between 11 and 1 or something. But I was going to ask you, there we go, because you asked me about it, and I know you share the same musical taste as I do, except for, your, you know, Britney Spears. Um, are you going to be there as well? Boy, you got to keep it alive. Yeah, I do. I really feel like I do. Stop mocking me. Although I guess I'm in... Already 30 minutes past yet, or... Can I still not make any self-deprecating jokes? Alright. Eh, might as well go to 40 here. That seems fine. Perhaps. <laughs> now that's not really... Um... How do you say that's not really... Answering my question, is it now? Okay, and what does it depend? Um. Oh, yeah, I also had these, uh, these Xanthus Ashes. Oh, really, really funky, but these Xanthus Ashes allow you to buy just the Jungrat branches. Really nice. And. Really, really, really uh, awesome if you get invaded and you're just like, oh, I don't want to fight. You can just transform into something that belongs into the object. And if there, if, if the invader doesn't watch carefully, uh, he can just miss you. So he's just um, running around looking for you and you're just like, there. yeah, I'm just going to ignore you. You're going to go away eventually. I just, that just happened to me a few times when uh, I was obviously farming for these uh, Sunlight Medals. And I, I got invaded a few times in, um, in uh, the Smoldering Lake. That I was behind the ramp leading up to the bonfire, if you go from the lake itself to the demon ruins. So I was just standing there behind the ramp, and they just didn't bother looking there. So there was this one guy, he was like a whole 15 minutes just looking for me, and I was just, uh, for, for fun's sake, popping uh, seeds seat of uh, uh, giant trees. So he just took some damage, and he was like, oh, he, he's watching me, he, he, he knows I'm here. And I could just see him from where I was standing, because well, third person, but he couldn't see me because there was this this these huge giants rocks in front of me. It was really really funny. But I was gonna go with the stupid PG something something joke and buy this. Yeah, sure, sure, whatever. And. Look at that well sculpted <laughs> backside. Uh, the developers put way too much love in 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 these legends, like really. Um, there we are. I'm not your mom. Do whatever makes you. What are you referring to? Okay, what does the behead refer to? Because I'm confused right now. Okay. 
Oh, there we go. Yeah, I know, right? I know. I know. No, I don't. Alright, so I can do a few few different things now. Oh, no, I know what I should do. I completely forgot about that. Danny, we will M NPC that stuck in, um, in the Orthal Dungeon. But, but yeah, I'm I'm confused. What do you mean by by perhaps? Um, I know you're not my mother because I saw her yesterday. Um, and she's 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 not um uh, savvy enough to go into a chat box. Oh. Okay. Um, where is that lift? I almost forget where the lift is. Is it there? Is it there? Is it though? Yes, it is. All right, cool. Oh. Oh, the thirty minutes were over. So you were you were just making empty threats earlier. All right, very good, very good. Uh, so I can make my 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 self tip getting dogs again. Yay! All right, now I need to bother with all these stupid jailers again. You know what? I've I've got bombs. Who am I kidding? I've got bombs. And apparently, a not so terrible aim. All right, that that is terrible. <laughs> oh, I love the, I love the side of that. I love these black fire bombs. Oh, oh, we've been noticed. We've been spotted. Yeah, no, no. They're gone again. <laughs> Sorry, it's it's just... Really, really funny. No? It's not funny? Oh. All right. Those were the bombs. Oh! And there goes my HP. My HP! Oh. Don't have a bow kit. I doubt that's what he said. Oh, although that should be what. No, no, no. That that sounds just homophobic, and I'm not. There we go. But uh, you've quite the cheeky mind there, uh, mutant. Yeah, 
Let's see, where should I be? Oh, there. Yay, soldering iron. Worst spear confirmed. There we are. Uh, I guess you got my intentions all wrong. That depends um, completely on how you would uh, 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 that, that kind, of, kind of depends on how you would, uh, 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 um... What's that tapping noise? I don't know, I'm just going for it. Um... If I were to say... Something like, yeah, that's a thing that some, that, that some males would say to some female, then some people are going to be like, Oh, you're treating that like a male can't say that to another male, or a female can't say that to a female. So you're being sexist. And I'm like, yeah, that's not what I mean. So just quick disclaimer. Uh, but yeah, she's just uh, like uh, a shard of the abyss. A shard of man is just like uh, Alexandra, the big bad of Dark Souls 2. And I'm, I, I don't care because she's, she's going to teach me some miracles. That was not a proposal. <sighs> you, you skinny little. <sighs> anyway. Doesn't that say more about your mind? Uh, I, I don't know my, yeah, I do know my mind for a large bit, but, you know, the professionals aren't really, um, um, l l let's just say that I'm supposed to be, like, for example, very, very, very intelligent, like, top percent is, like, like, uh, you know, like a certain ratata, top percentage, well, I, I, I'm, not, I'm just not feeling it. I'm just not feeling it, and that my mind is, is old and weird and chaotic, but that's true, and yeah, it, it's just weird. I mean, I'm thinking in layers and layers and layers of layers, so there we go. I guess... Yeah, you should have noticed by now, it, it, is, it is really a weird, weird place. Let's see, uh... And the ironic part is, you can't get a single sorcery. Oh no, you can actually get two sorceries from her. But you can only deposit like, um... What's it called? Um... Parmesan stones and, and, and divine, uh, Domes to her, and not... Uh, uh, sorcery scrolls. And apparently I'm wicked. And we knew that I am wicked. And that's a real clue that humanity is the dark soul. That the dark soul is humanity. That again was telepathy. Wait, you were putting that in my mind? or You're, you're, you're weirding me out. Alright, so she has two, um, two, two, two uh, spells of her own. 
Uh, Affinity, which is a really nice dark spell. Uh, forbidden Dark Sorcery costs a dark manifestation of humanity. And uh, if you've played the um, Dark Souls 1 DLC, these are actually humanity sprites. And you can find them in the abyss, in the darkness. So here we have just another on the nose hint that like a hey, dark soul refers to humanity uh dun 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 it appears to be an expression of envy or perhaps love towards another that will tenaciously tenaciously pursue its target even if like so many human art, it amounts to nothing but misfortune and here we have dark edge another forbidden dark sorcery strike with blade formed of humanity's darkness Passed from mother to daughter, this blade was intended for both protection and as a means of taking one's own life. The young girl never swung it more than once. Now I don't know what to make of that tale, but it, it's right there. This is basically just um, my fair found great dark, but then the dark version of it. All right. You know, this conversation does give a really creepy vibe. But that is because Fire Wednesdays were the original sorceries. Really, I'm a Finnish little lad. Alright, but, but these are the uh, sorceries, sorceries we get. These are the uh, ones from uh, the uh, 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 Kulana Stone, and these are the uh, Grey Farmer Stone. So basically, if you go for a hybrid uh, Paro, then the Blackfire Orb is one of the spells that you really, really want. Uh, Hurls a Black Fireball, the Black Flame inflicts dark damage, striking targets with weighty force. So, for a large part, you're going to do uh, fire damage and dudes that are resistant to fire are often weak to um to dark damage so just add this to your inventory black flame this is another um counterpart to a regular version of pyromancy this is the dark variant creates a giant black flame enhanced black flames born from the abyss bear no shadow they are said to be the impenetrable fires of humanity dun 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 i could ask what your favorite color of food is Right, 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 yeah. I'm I'm just not interesting, that's all, that's all. Alright, fire whip, this is uh not a serious permits to use for damage, I think, but it, it's it's quite okay to, to create distance between you and someone else or close distance. Uh Firestorm is a nice spell. Uh, surrounds the caster with multiple pillars of flame. It's slow, but it does leave lava behind, so you do create a zone around you that's damaging. Alright, advanced experiments of Kulana, a daughter of the Witch of Isolith, uh, charms the enemy, making it a temporary ally. The living are lured by flame, and this tendency is elemental to the art of pyromancy. And we have these alone skills, and th this basically is the spell variant of it. All right. Yeah, X D D D D. Yeah. Completely that X D D D. Hello, I'm standing right here. Yeah, who's your master now, eh?
just really the insinuation. It's it's really really bad. All right. So we got also some dark uh, uh, miracles, like dark blade. I really really like. You know, this is just the same as dark Moon blade, the same as lightning blade, the same as Garth's flame arc, except it adds dark damage. And I think that's a, a that's a great one to add to my inventory. And this is another reference to the sepulchers here. Miracle of the sepulchers of Londor reinforces right weapon with dark. The third daughter of uh, Lillian, one of the founders of the sepulchers, is said to recount tales that portray the suffering and conflict of hollows. Now we actually met one of the founders of the Sable Church, um, namely Yoria is one of the founders. We will meet a second one in uh, one of the DLCs, and the third one, Liliana, we will not meet in any way, shape, or capacity. I'm gonna buy this one. Uh, Vow of Silence prevents spell in vicinity, including one's own. Members of Visible Church are all trained swordsmen and each sworn only to their weapons as they bear the leaden si Latin silence of Londor. Uh, situational miracle, um, for example, however, if you are facing Aldrich after you've done Irithal Dungeon, all his attacks, basically all his attacks are spells. So pop this bad boy and he won't be able to attack you. It does have a really, really, really short uh, um, time. Not more than a few seconds, but it does it does prevent it from, from attacking. Uh, Sacrilegious a miracle of the Civil Church of Londor bless corpses, transforming them into traps. Basically, if you have corpses around you, they go... Uh, Londor, the Hollow Realm, is a society of undead, compromised by corpses and shades of those who led unsavory lives. Is such a blessing really something one must ponder? I guess... I guess so. Uh, Deep Protection is quite a nice spell. Uh, slightly boosts attack, damage absorption and resistance, while also increasing stamina recovery speed. The Deep was originally a peaceful and sacred place, but became the final rest for many abhorrent things. This tale of the Deep offers protection for those who worship amidst those horrors. I'm just gonna buy it. And here we have the original Gnoll. Dark Miracle thought by the Cathedral of the Deep. These insects which lurk in the Deep have tiny jaws lined with fangs to tear open the skin and burrow into the flesh in the blink of an eye, causing intense breathing. And well, that's, that is quite graphic. Yeah, I know, we're back on that track once again. Like we said, we're, we're either going to rate it PG-16, PG-18, or M for Mature. Alright, so now I have some extra miracles, and I may just go ahead for 24 Fate after this. So I can have one more spell slot. But I feel for now I should um, I don't need this for now. And I do like my some my spare. So from here on out, let's see, uh Dance of the Portal Valley, we did we did her. I'm sitting here for way too long. All right, you can actually trigger, 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 uh, trigger her boss fight early just by walking up to Emily here and go like, "Damn, don't care about you." Just kill her, and the dancer should should, uh, should appear. Um, but yeah, if you can take her on, that's that's a whole different story. If you're good. Okay, I'm not that good, so I'm not gonna do that. Um, but now we can enter the bulk of Lothric Castle. This is basically just just downtown Lothric, and this is the the uh, rich part. Now we can go a few ways. We can go this way. Uh, no, I was gonna go that way. And uh, we can see a cathedral knight over there, and there is a garden. below us and that's again a toxic area 
Toxic Swamp. And behind there, there's a boss fight. It's an optional boss fight, you don't need to do that, but it does give you access to some... Uh... Oh, right, there was some screaming in the distance. I've never heard that before. I sincerely, I've never heard that before. But it gives you access to some uh, to some op optional areas, and you can get some, some nice... Uh, um... Um, nice stuff there, and also nice farming spots for, um, for example, uh, Black Knights, their attire. That's a one-way drop, right over here. But first, we are gonna go this way. We're gonna find the new and improved Lothric Knights, and. These hollow priests who are really, really annoying. So I'm just gonna go ahead and kill the guy. Mind you, these uh, hollow priests on their own, they are not threatening at all. They don't do anything except buff. That's all they do. They buff and heal. There we go. I missed. He buffs. Uh, this buff decreases the damage they take, you can see that. First I hit them for 18, now I hit them for like less. And that's a heal. And that's really annoying because that over there is a red-eyed knight, so it, it's gonna do quite some damage. Come on. You're still buffed, aren't you? Uh, not anymore. Cool. What's my... This is too heavy for me. Well, we don't have the game sounds. Yeah, I know it's a good topic. Did you lose the game sounds? See, you're not hearing this? Let me just let me just check. Let me just check on the screen. All right, there we go. It's been silent this whole time for you. You should have told me. You should have told me. Yeah, that's that's not enough, you know. Who want, who wants to hear just my voice? There we go. You should have sound now. Right, tell me you have sound. I didn't notice. What, what didn't you notice? No, it wasn't sound? Just, just until now, you realized there was no sound at all? 
I don't know what to think of that. Oh. Come on then, charge me, charge me. No, that's not the one I was going for. Ooh. That's the one I was going for, but... Oh. Come on, charge me, charge me. There we go. Alright, so these guys drop Titanite Shards, they drop Titanite Chunks, uh, Sunlight Metals, and the Priests drop Blessed Gems. So if you're into that. But, ah, oh, you, you hear the game. Cool, cool, cool. Alright, so here we have an aggressive dude. Come on, come, come on, usually you are aggressive. Why so shy? Now you got buffed. And there you lost your buff. Yeah. There we go. Wait, 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 wait. Oh no, 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 no. Two on one is not fair. That's not fair at all. Ah. Uh, do not agree. Do not, do, did not agree with this. Alright, time, time to take out these stupid priests first. There we go. And there's another one just over here. Oh, oh, he worked up the guts to attack me. <laughs> How rude. Anyway, how about you guys? Yeah, you better block. That hurt. Uh, come on. Uh, I I guess I guess uh, you're right, mutant. I guess you're right. Should I should I turn the? Uh, let me just. Uh, you know, just just for the other viewers. Um, I mean, let me just. With the desktop, the, the audio a bit down. How about now? Is this a is this a good combination? Um, so we can go further into Lothric Castle, um, but there are actually some, some places I want to reach first, uh, because of Fashion Souls. I'm gonna do that. But here we have the Skirt of Prayer, and that's a reference to our fourth and last Lord of Cinder, Prince Lothric. The prince, destined to be a lord of cinder, was cherished by the royal family despite being born into illness, a frail and shriveled child. His swaddling clothes were made of aged coarse cloth used in ancient prayer and are all that he has ever worn. And that does back the question. If this is all he has ever worn, and it's here. Is he naked right now? I mean, asking the important questions here? I know there aren't any other viewers on my live stream, but you know, on YouTube, you know, because this is going to go on YouTube. 
All right, let me just quickly. Yeah. I'm gonna go into the these garden first um, and open up another shortcut. Man, those screams. They're freaking me out. Finally doing some damage with this spell. No. You can jump off early off this lift. Like this. You can grab an item here. As a shard. And down here. That much junk. Nice. And yeah, these guys. But luckily weak to fire, so there's the and then I might just go ahead and grab and cheese these guys out because I don't care. But yeah, toxic. There we go. Not impressed. Or wait, wait. Am I? Am I that unimpressive? No, that's the wrong thing. That's not what I want to do at all. That's what I wanted to do. No! No, that's not what I want to do. Stupid buttons. Oh. There we go. That's what I wanted to do. Alternatively, you can just lure him uh, over there and you can just run circles around the lift uh, until he gets toxic and dies. I mean, that's also an option. And here I'm probably gonna get toxic. Alright, the shadow set, essence armor, claws, and some black fire bombs. Because why the crap not? And this is actually quite nice of the game to give you this hint like use fire in this bit. Alright, let, let me kill my toxic. And be prepared to face these abominations. Alright, that does way too little damage. No. There we go. I don't know if you can see it, but here we have an auto mode message. Um, because because you were like biatch, mutant. Very good. Just watch your full mouth. Wait, you got all followers. That's our that's our sar sarcasm right there, isn't it? You are being sarcastic. 
like 100%. Oh, not good, not good, not good, not good. Better. Yes, you are very good at sarcasm. I noticed, thank you. I don't have a lot of followers, I know. I mean, at the most, there are three people that, that respond to my videos, so actually comments. So, but it, it's a start, right? It's a start. You've got to start somewhere. Oh, hello, you. Oh. Ouch. No, no. No, no, no. Don't. Oh, there goes my stamina. Oh, he was alive. Oh, that was close. There we go. things are here yeah, just a dark gem and there should be yeah there we go another chunk all right all righty where are my there we go Yeah, but that's why you should spread the word, you know, like, and create a whole, whole, whole goal or something, I don't know. Anyway, there's a boss fight just behind that guy, uh, and these guys are annoying, so I'm just gonna not face them like this. Instead, you can get a shortcut. Once more, once again. Alright. So you can jump down there and you can actually uh, get up onto a ramp where you can face these cathedral knights uh, from a place where it's difficult for them to reach you, but you can just uh, stand there with a bow or something and just shoot them in the head until they die. And a Titan skill, very, very nice. Oh. 
up we go. Just another chunk. You sound like someone from Family Guy. Wait a minute, wait a minute. I don't know if I should uh, take that as a compliment. I'm not really sure. But yeah, it, it 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 all is a conspiracy theory. So so yeah, you're right. You're right on that front. You you are right on that front. All right, time to time to uh, I know. I just could progress farther into the uh, Lothar Castle, the Grand Archives, back to Lothar Castle. I could also do some sidetracking, go into the DLC. I don't know. Alright, time to get more. Do I need more FP? I do like some more uh, uh, stamina, so. But I also need more damage for my faith stuff, so. Sure. Why are we here on Earth? You know, like, I honestly do not know. Um, the scientist in me is gonna say to procreate, but you know, I'm not not, not really looking to to spread my genes. That doesn't seem like a good idea. Like, not at all. Oh, yeah, right. Before we continue, we can actually do do this guy's questline. Actually. Uh. Are you coding lyrics again, mutant? All right, here we at least have. No, no, it's Yellowfinger Hazel, right there. Reborn. More than five times. Ending up like one of these worm thingies. Yeah. Mm, let me see what I need to do to trigger... Um... I, do, I don't know, I don't know. We've got to do this. I don't know if my kids would be nice. I mean, so, some people think that I'm, like, pretty much the Antichrist. So, um, maybe my kids will be too, like, like Devil's Spawn or something. I don't know. Huh. Yeah. Secret died. His last little nap. It was one for the ages. Yeah, that's a thing. We don't have a bright future. Um, machines taking over, that's actually a thing because AI research is very, very uh, hot right at the moment. But it's it's so hard for, for us to um, imagine how a machine would see everything in this world because we are pretty much incapable of perceiving things uh, through a, a, a perfect objective lens. 
our emotions, our upbringing, you know, our culture, our, our, our values, they all play a way in the role. Uh, they all play a role in the way we perceive the, the world around us. So, an AI is just truly and completely alien to, to everything that, that we are. Because it doesn't have all that. It can perceive things for what they really are, while we cannot. And while some things are indeed for us, as we perceive them, that's for, you know, like, us individually. Because that's, that's, that's our singular truth. And, you know, the grounded truth, we can't, we, we, can, we can only uh, perceive glimpses of that. Because we, we are always subjective. We are not objective. <laughs> it's really, really hard. Well, I guess uh, if if you've given um, the uh, 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 Rajai's fingers a pill tongue, and you progress far enough into the game, then Leonhard should appear. Um, Right there behind me. And then we can continue his quest line. And I thought that reallocating your stats does count as. Nope. Offering a Piltong, but apparently it doesn't. So now. There he is. Sneaky, sneaky bastard. Um. Yeah, that is true. That is true. Um. But he does. He does have his own inner conflicts, right? He does have his own emotions. Yeah, he does have, he does have them, he does have them. Um, you know, that's actually one of the albums I do not have. Um, the, the, the theory of everything. Let's see, uh, Institute of Electronic Castle, Universal Migrator, Space Metal, Source, Human Equation. I actually do not have. Isn't it the future asking the real questions AI about math? Yeah, well, we already know the answer. It's 42. It's just another question. I mean... All right, I won't. Let's see if we can get him to progress his questline. No. You've heard the whole all oh you were You can't have been waiting that long. I was like ten minutes ten minutes late. Fifteen tops. I know I'm always late. Except the first time, I wasn't late. And someday I'm not going to be late, because I want to be there in time. Uh, I'm actually also a fan of one of the bands in the, uh, in the, in the, in the that, that place before, uh, Annika. Uh, Scar Symmetry, love them. Well, I say that. I haven't ha actually listened to their uh, later albums, because I was a really big fan of one of their, of, of, of their lead singer. And their lead vocalist, and they, they he, he parted ways. And you know, just to replace that one guy, they had to hire two guys. 
and you know everything went downhill from there. Now that's not true. It's still epic, but it's not the same anymore. Anyway, the Black Eye Orb and Rosario appears to be dead. <sighs> Doesn't really matter because you can still do everything that you could, you know, before she died. But she's dead. Stuff happened. Then we get the Black Eye Orb. So we can use that to invade one specific world. And in order to do that, we need to go to here. You were working on what? Or do you actually have a job on Sunday? Because then I would not, uh, that I would not, uh, um, 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 um. Oh no, 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 I was thinking, oh, we should, I'm gonna go for it. Ah, I get distracted, oh no, attention span, attention deficit, no! I don't see how that is relevant, <laughs> I really don't see how that is relevant. There we go. So what kind of work do you do? If if you uh, dare tell me. Oh, like that. <gasps> oh no, we feel our black eye or quivering. All right, all right. Let's uh, touch our uh, black black thingy, shall we? Let's see what happens. So here you are invading him and he just starts monologuing, just redo the, the sensible thing and attack him. But his weapon is actually faster than mine, so... Almost did him in. And that's why I like that. That hyper armor. You can just poise through everything. Oh, nice. Well. <laughs> oh, that's not skull shot at all. Uh no, right, but we we did get um, some items. Uh, by the way, we can buy his uh, his outfit now at the uh, at the uh, Firelink uh, Handmaiden, the Shrine Handmaiden, whatever he's called. We get his mask in his youth. Leonard suffered grave burns to his entire body. His face, in particular, which he hid beneath his mask, was terribly scalded. Uh, he abstained from restoring these injuries even after becoming a um, finger of Rosaria, so he could just change his, his appearance, but apparently he didn't. We also get his uh, his uh, crescent moon sword, a type of shuttle imbued with the power of the moon. Leonard set out on a journey of rebirth, but decided instead to serve the goddess as a knight, and inherited this weapon. So Rosario confirmed is a goddess. And we also got the soul of Rosaria. 
the soul of the Rosalia, mother of rebirth, stolen by Ringfinger Leonhard. Return this to her extant corpse, and Mother Rosario will spring back to life, as if nothing had ever happened. Do you know that uh, the way the way this soul looks, this is one of the few God souls we can obtain, and it looks just hugely, vastly different from any other soul that we have. No right, time to. To, 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 to go back to Firelink. Yeah, it's very cool. It is very cool. I uh, do note that it, you, ha you have a Rosaria's uh, soul, right? So we can actually go ahead and transpose it like here. Soul Rosaria. Gradually restore high HP for self and broad area. And is there anything else that we can get from her? So I don't know. Don't think so. No, just just that. And you don't even need to return that soul because she will just perform as you know. The, the, the hub for the uh, covenants without a soul, without you know being actually alive. So there is that. Let's upgrade our weapons a bit. All right, time for time for depleting your dialogue. All right. Yeah, stupid dish Do you have anything else to say? No. Cool. Why are you googling that guy? Yeah, I know, I can't multitask. I am well aware. I am well aware, actually. I am really, really aware, well aware. Durr. Alright, time to go to the boss fight of the... Uh, the gardens here and see if we can actually manage to summon an NPC to make the fight a bit, bit, bit uh, easier. But, but why are you googling that guy? Because I said that my children were, uh, you know, like devil spawn or would be devil spawn. Alright, just a Thrall Axe, nothing exciting. And let's go to... Sure could. Yeah, I don't, I don't, I don't, I don't care. I don't care if you disagree. I am evil, remember? I'm the evil overlord. Well, this is not the summon I was talking about. Dragon skill ring. Oh, I don't know what that thing did. I totally forgot that essence flask. 
Dragon skill ring reduces damage from backstabs. Well, oh, that's that's not too shabby. All right, so here we are. Let's let's just uh, cheese these stupid knights. Maybe I should just use regular arrows. I mean, even if they got your evil 50%, what about the other 50%? That totally depends on uh, the woman willing to uh, mate with me. I mean, I guess you have to be pretty insane. So I don't know. I don't know how that helps. And yes, while he's standing there, he can just actually reach you with reach you with his uh, great sword. There we go, that's one. That's one down. Yeah, that's no that yeah, yeah, I know, you know. Definition of definition of insanity. That did a whole six damage. Wow. I'm impressed. I am impressed. Thoroughly impressed. Oh man, look at all these arrows sticking out of his head. That, that can't be good for your health. I mean, seriously. You should see a doctor. Or an eye doctor at least. There we go. A guaranteed magic stone plate ring. For crop. Always nice. And there should be... There should be... A NPC is right here. So I don't know what happened there. See, I know what I'm talking about. I know what I'm talking about. I'm just gonna quickly check if if I forgot something for his questline. And I'm so glad that you guys can't see my my uh, my desktop screen. You know, while I do this. You know, well, streaming with OBS. All right. Well, I'm not sure why there is no summon sign here, uh, and I don't want to go back to, it may depend on a ring if I have that or not, and if I have that, it's in my, I don't have it here, right? No, I don't have it here. It's in my inventory box, and I'm, I'm willing to just go ahead and check, so I'm just, just going to go to the to the boss fight and don't care about him. Huh? That's the boss, by the way, that you're here. That's that's the boss. I, d I do not understand your statement, mutants. 
I do not understand your statements. That that's not why I can think of one. And that's not why I agree with you, I, I guess. That's what I said, right? I agree with you. That's not because no, 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 that's not the reason. This is an insane guy who was so into sorcery that he actually transformed himself into a dragon-like being. And he is so insane that he doesn't even notice that he doesn't have all slots in his arms. That still doesn't explain your statement, mutant. That still doesn't explain it. Alright, this guy uses uh, physical damage, he uses sorcery, he can inflict curse buildup, and he is weak to lightning. Oh. And in this stage of the fight, he, you can just stay underneath them, nothing wrong. As you can see, he takes a massive amount of damage. But fate two is where things get nasty. He goes completely feral once he notices that he doesn't have his child with him. And that's why I like to have an NPC here because the NPC can just distract him. But you do hear the sounds of a child crying. So that's kind of disturbing. There we go. No, 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 no. Uh, and that, that's not why I... No, because then people are going to make stupid comments about... Um, uh, that, that I have Pokemon Showdown on my on my desktop. Or that kind of stuff. I don't... I'm, I'm not an idiot. I have a separate folder for that. Duh. What do you think? Uh, but what would I rather? Date an angel or a demon? Well, now we're asking the important questions. Let me just, uh... Oh, I guess I should deliver these at some point. Um... Hithal with it blue for some reason. Uh, Soul of Osiris, the consumed king, one of the twisted souls steeped in strength, dun dun dun. Osiris went mad trying to harness his royal blood for greater purpose, leading him to the heretics of the Grand Argives, where he discovered the twisted worship of Seath the Pale Drake. And that's a character from Dark Souls 1 and the uh, lore behind the whole game. Um, now there's this interesting fan theory that Ocelot is actually Yorska. Because she does have these bit of these draconic features like scales and the, 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 her tail. And that just like um, uh, Gwendolyn, he looks female but he's actually male. That she also is male but is because she's associated with the moon, as sorceress or as well, that she's just really, really feminine. Are dressed all white or all black? That depends a 
bit on 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 who would be wearing it, but then I'm gonna go with white. Yeah, white. Although I do, don't like to wear white myself, so I'd go with black myself. And they were even nice, nice contrast. No, 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 I, I, no, actually, no, actually, actually, no. And I'm gonna tell you why, because I'm, I'm not doing such stuff lightly, um, I would, I'd, I like to have, you know, the feeling it has to be there, so I'm not just gonna do stuff for fun, or anyway. So yeah, that's that's it's just not there. It, it it's just not gonna happen. <sighs> Snake eater. All right, really important gesture, path of the dragon. This, by the way, is a direct Drake Blood Knight. Then for some reason another basin, but. Yeah. All right, nice, nice chest here. Sorry, it is, it is, it is true. Um, you know, fault me over it, but if it was offered to me, then I'd either just decline it and nothing else, or I'd, you know, be somehow. Anxious and start to question the lo loyalty of, you know, my significant other. Because I am a, I am always a bit insecure about those things. Even if it's not necessary. Even if I know that it's not necessary, I do feel insecure. And that's also maybe a reason why I wouldn't like that. Because then I'd be like, yeah, you know, if maybe, maybe, maybe I'm the third wheel and... I just wouldn't do that. No, no, no. All right. Um, right. Untended graves. This is actually going to be familiar in a bit. And I don't know why I don't. There we go. Yeah. For some reasons, there are corpions here. You're mocking me, aren't you? There we go, that's another Shriving Stone. Because we care about that. Yeah, you're right, you're right. I mock myself enough as it is. Thank you very, very much. You know, and I'm not sure if I, if I even want to meet you uh, next week. Come on, you lame Corvians. Yeah, take your time, why don't you? Yeah. There you go. Come on. Attack me. Be aggressive. Well, those are quite some nice visuals. Oh. I dodged way too early for that. Yeah, go ahead. Scream. I'll give you a reason to scream. There we go. Alright, as an SS ring, but this, this is a familiar place. You know why? Because this is where we started the game. Well, I'm 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 glad that you're that that you feel like that. Um, 
Although I'm not sure if you're referring to me saying that I'm not sure if I want to meet you. But... That's, that's okay, that's okay, I forgive you. But yeah, the, these are basically just... Um, this is the start of the game, but... The sky completely black. There are no stars. There's no sun. It's well hidden. It's an optional area of the game. So something must have happened here. So what could have happened here? Well, we will find out eventually. A soul of Crushed Fallen Knight. And there are grave wardens here. Oh, oh, that hurt. That hurt way too much. I am so used to great swords and being able to stagger stuff that this is a really weird experience for me. Ah, ah, second one. Alright, let me just. Uh... Oh, no, 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 Oh, low key mini heart attack. Well, you should never be quiet about that. That's one of the worst things you can do, to be honest. Because if 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 you do have that kind of of bond with someone, and you are at the point that you do feel that that insecurity, then you need to be able to to talk to each other. It's it's not only a sign of trust, but it it also helps develop that that bond. And you know, if you're really there, you know, then there is absolutely no reason to feel like that. And it's still totally natural to do it. But if it's okay, then your significant other will reassure that it's it's not there, and he will try and make you feel that it's just just all right. And I should be looking into the camera, not at my screen. 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 How can I look at a screen? I mean, that's a painting. Anyway, I hope you understand what I mean. Just just some uh, uh, good men's advice or something. Gee, how obvious can it be that English is not his native language? Stupid, stupid, stupid! Dogs. Alright, just some tight enough junk and I'm gonna go this bit this way. But yeah, you you have you have to be you you Yeah You should say those things out loud. Because you know, even in the worst situation, you know um you, you you know what's about to gonna happen, and in a better situation, you will let your partner know that you trust them, and it'll be all right. Unless you're really overprotective, which is another matter entirely, but. That's not the ultimate test to see if someone is Dutch. That would be Scheveningen. Stroomwafel. 
Only if they know what it is. You know. Let me do, let me do these guys one at a time. I'm not so keen on fighting, fighting both of them. Right, come here, come here. Ducky, ducky, ducky. Well, lizard, lizard, lizard. Yes, you're big. I know. Come on, come on. You can do it. Yeah, he did it. And quickly, there we go. That's one down. Bruh, too soon? Scheveningen? Or my, my... What was too soon? Help me out here. Help me understand. I just do not understand. All right, help me out. What's too soon? Uh, we're about to get invaded, if I'm correctly. There we go. She used the sorceries and she will bury the freck out of you. Oh, that's a lot of damage. I got one shot. It. <sighs> All right. So Mutant has left me. I'm all alone. So it's time for me to uh Bring this to an end. Alright guys, thank you guys for watching and I'll catch you next time. Probably will be um recording tomorrow. Just just regular recording and be live next week. So keep an eye out on any announcement about the time. And I'll catch you guys. Cheers.